Hey there. How's it going? Good? Good. Excellent. Now, unless you've been living under some kind of rock, you will probably have heard about the caveman paleo diet that's doing the rounds. If you have been living under a rock, you're probably doing it naturally anyway, because that seems to be what it's about. Lots of protein and grains. No, no grains. Or is it nuts or seeds? Or I can't really remember. Now, obviously, here in the Lupin kitchen, there is no caveman diet and no paleo diet. I like chips and gravy way too much for that. But I have picked up one or two little recipe ideas from blogs, Pinterest, things around this amazing diet. One of my favourite is ham and egg muffins because they make a delicious, filling and reasonably healthy lunch. To make them, get some greaseproof paper and cut a couple of strips. Now, I haven't seen this method being used before, but to be honest, these muffins are really bloody hard to get out of the tin. Maybe that's part of the exercise that you do. You eat clean, you train dirty. Training includes flipping tires, running 27 miles, and wrestling eggs out of tins. Life is too short for that. I cut strips to help me get them out later. You cut the strip in half, and you put it in a little cross across your baking tin, like so. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Yes, I'm not really the tire flipping type, am I? No, I don't think that's going to work really at all for me. Then you get some slices of cured ham. I'm using smoky black forest ham because, well, that's what's cheapest in my nearest supermarket. But, uh, you know, you could use parma ham, serrano ham, any sort of ham you want. And you're doing with the ham kind of what you did with the bits of paper. Doing them in two little crosses across the way and doing that with two slices so that you have a muffin tin lined with a little bit of greaseproof paper and a little bit of the ham. There we go. There we go. Now I'm going to bring this down a little bit so that you can hopefully see what I'm doing a little bit more next time. Okay, so we have two bits of paper crossed like this. A slice of ham that we cut in half like so. We put one slice of ham in like that, and then one slice of ham like that. So it's kind of like a little crisscross. And then we do the same with one more slice of ham, so that we are filling in the gaps. Marvellous. 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 Voila. What we do is we grab an egg and we crack it in to there and we crack one in to there. We sprinkle over a couple of grinds of black pepper and we grate over a little bit of cheese, whatever cheese floats your boat really. I had some cheddar floating around the little pink kitchen, so that's what I'm doing. And that's the sort of, there we go, that's, I'm going to say the sort of cheddar that might crumble a bit better than it grates. So I'll choose to do that rather than grating it. Did cavemen grate stuff? I don't really know. I should do some research into that. But I'm too busy eating clean, training dirty, and then having chips and gravy. <laughs> Then what you do is you pop it in the oven for between 12 and 15 minutes until the eggs are nice and set. In you go. Timer on. See you soon. So then, after, well, let's 
be honest, that 12 to 15 minutes thing I told you about was bollocks. These bad boys took 20. You can take your little muffins out of the oven. Ready to roll. Then you can put them on a pretty serving plate like so. No wrestling required. And then you can serve them with a paleo caveman favourite like avocado salad or nuts or not grains, no grains allowed or something like that. Or you can serve them with what our forefathers ate, actually ate, which around these parts was chips and gravy. Enjoy!